prepare for the 50th anniversary of the Bond franchise with a new film by the director whose most famous action scene to date was this. Skyfall, the overrated movie that thrilled audiences worldwide only because it was way better than Quantum of Solace. Suit up with 007, the super secret MI6 agent, who everyone knows by his real name. Bond. 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 Mr. Bond. Mr. Bond. James Bond. James Bond. In an opening so action-packed, you'll forget to ask yourself, why didn't the conductor stop this train when its entire back carriage was ripped off? And why aren't these people scared? When Bond is abruptly killed, It'll only take the length of one Adele song before he anticlimactically pops up in the most secluded corner of the globe that conveniently has CNN in English. Minutes of the explosion. But when Bond returns to the high-stakes world of espionage, he's faced with word association. Word. Sky. Office politics. The Prime Minister's ordered an inquiry. You'll have to appear. Art theory. Judy Dench frowning. A lot. And absurdly long landscape shots. Meet Raul Silva, the Bond villain we've been waiting for because he doesn't show up until halfway through the movie. An antagonist with a plan so complex, he wants to get caught, but makes it nearly impossible to find him, knows months ahead of time the exact place to plant explosives during a chase he didn't even know was going to happen, and makes Bond gay. Oh, Mr. Bond. Discover the latest in super secret gadgetry like a gun, a knife, a shotgun, an old timey gun, dynamite, and a tracking device larger than the one Bond used in the 60s. Here's a nice little transmitting device. It'll be fitted into the heel of your shoe. Bond will use these tools to hunt down a terrorist who stole a list of secret agents. The computer drive containing the identity of almost every NATO agent. Which the writer stole from the plot of Mission Impossible. A film with action so artsy, you'll strain to watch fight scenes shot in total darkness. An ending so goofy, they just ripped it off from Home Alone. <laughs> so sexually aggressive, you'll wonder, isn't he sort of raping that former child prostitute? Jesus. Starring Jason Bourne, Fred from Scooby-Doo, Lindsay Lohan, Random Bond Girl number 732, Miss Money Penny's Black, Gollum, Santa Claus, and Sexy Voldemort, Skyfall. Wait, whatever happened to that hard drive they were looking for? Wasn't that the whole point of the movie? No? Okay. <laughs>